Hello guys, welcome to part 2 of this PvE loadout series. In this video I'm going to be covering my suggested secondary and melee weapons and what kind of grenades you should be using in PvE. As mentioned in my last video, if you want to earn as much Warface dollar profit as possible, then using the default weapons that you're given is a perfectly valid strategy, and in this case the high power pistol is perfectly fine. However, it's quite inaccurate and only has a 15 clip size, so if you want to upgrade to one of our vendor pistols, you can go for the M900. It's a fantastic clip size of 30. However, if you want a bit more accuracy in your life, you can grab the ZX84 USP from our shop. But if you've got premium currency, you can look to get the WX86, which has 26 bullets in the clip and has both semi and fully automatic modes. Once again, if you want to go for maximum profit, the Executor Knife is perfectly valid. But if you want to upgrade to one of our vendor weapons, you can grab the Sapper Shovel. My suggested shop purchase is the Survival Tanto Knife, the fastest knife in the game. And if you want to go premium, everybody loves the Katana. Last but not least, I suggest you grab a full set of smoke grenades, especially for those special operation missions. So that wraps it up for this secondary melee and grenade video. If you've got any questions, please do leave them in a comment below. If you want to watch the previous or next videos in the series, you can click the links on your screen now. Don't forget to subscribe for more Warface videos, and I'll see you in game.